good morning nigeria good morning africa good morning and uh, the world at large yeah uh. <laughs> okay you know i call him john no, i really like the way he introduced himself and then he just adjusts and became serious because you're expecting something very hard like a very hard question to continue no, no. okay hard question yeah we just here and yeah are there hard no. questions no no of course okay. very soft john and best you yes. saw the the report you saw the, the what happened use. to that young copper you know and then um, from the report there it was linked to drug drug intake by the youth or by the people who do who carry out this act so for you what is your take on that? all right um what i watched the report it's quite uh, pathetic it's quite um uninteresting to me you know i saw i uh, see that the 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 core member there is actually a staff of NTO, or is actually with nta yes, put yes, here yeah. it's quite Seven pathetic minutes. somebody that just came to put yes. that is more like the first impression, impression they've given to the young yeah, man there. Yeah. too bad too bad it's all uh, as a result of drugs yeah i think uh, the people that said that they're correct to say you know all of the societal ills are uh, as a result of um, the intake of the high intake of drugs in the society in fact the uh the talk about drug abuse say it okay. call it drug abuse okay now. sorry you, you know why we are relating it to drugs because he said looking at them that he knew they were under the influence of a drug that he, you know for them after collecting his phones they pushed him out they were just in human of course soul. no no normal person yes. no 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 young person or whether old or young person mm -hmm. that is in his or her right minds or right senses mm -hmm. would do what such people have actually done mm. do you understand you collected somebody's phone and then you uh you pushed the person out not considering the fact that a vehicle another vehicle from behind could actually mm -hmm. you know the across person. the person yeah. and then that becomes the end mm -hmm. of that person's mm -hmm. life and all of that mm -hmm. of course myself i cannot do that you cannot do that your children that are not under, under the your, your children that are not under the influence of uh, drugs yes. they, will not yeah. do that. they can't do that a normal yeah. person cannot do yes. that so he's very correct to say that yeah. my, my 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 concern now is um where he said he noticed that they are that is he suspected so what should have uh, what he should have actually done i don't know if he did not notice that before he entered perhaps it has happened before he entered mm -hmm. so if he had actually noticed that before he entered he should have declined maybe looking at their faces okay mm -hmm. i'm not seeing the faces these faces i'm seeing they are not so cool i'm not cool with them so i have to i think i'll just retrace i'll just go back step mm -hmm. back they will not push you into the vehicle right they'll just perhaps the way they do it is look at this one jjc mm -hmm. and they'll move on so what is expected of us these days mm -hmm. is to uh, say that before we enter into a, uh, any public transport be it a tricycle mm -hmm. be it uh, uh, taxis of any kind buses and all of that you should observe yes. be very very observant yes. Yes. right be very very observant of the people that are yes. inside if possible even look try to see the plates uh, um, number. the number plates number. right yeah. check the number plates if you can cram it if you so that if anything happens as such mm -hmm. You could easily trace that right mm -hmm. i think that's that's a cool yes. uh, safety yes. measure we could actually do yes. so be, be observant watch very well before you enter into any cab mm -hmm. right i think that would be cool. i think i had experience like that just around this in boba i wanted to board a cab and then the one of them came down and asked me to enter there was one already at the park okay and there were two of them but the second person came out and said i should enter i said no okay you sit there i think while that, I enter. that's very yes. relatable and it's i relatable. refuse so when he looked at me and saw that i if he said look at her i better go bad market exactly do you that's, understand that's and i said to myself them. wow so this is how i just entered one chance so definitely when you when you see such mm -hmm. you shouldn't uh, you should just know that something is wrong right something is fishy somewhere i cannot uh where this is a public transport i want to enter and then you're already there mm -hmm. and then you're expecting it to go in you're yeah, coming down yes. for me to go in go so in. you so they will just call her, yeah. no 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 no. that should that's strange to mm -hmm. me i see it as a strange act so uh, of course that already uh, brings suspicion okay it's so already now we're looking at the you. effect of drugs yes effect of drugs especially when these drugs are abused yes okay we are looking at it the first of all what of is drugs. this uh, what what's what's this drug abuse okay. now what's okay. what's it i call it a deliberate um a deliberate uh, use of what drugs Sim yeah. deliberate use, use. misuse yeah. of drugs okay. that's okay. it okay. i call it del deliberate because 
I, I I discovered that this young persons or whoever takes drugs right now, it's not just about the young persons mm -hmm. again, but I mm -hmm. do know that it's more uh, uh, with, profound with, in, yes, amongst young, young persons, persons right? Yeah. Yes. It's deliberate because before you go into this thing, you know that you're, you, you've seen already it's happening mm -hmm. and you're already seeing the result. You see, you're seeing the effect of these things on people or in people. And you're still going, you're still going into So that makes it work. It's deliberate. Mm -hmm. Isn't it deliberate? Mm -hmm. Now, the only thing we don't know, some of the, the causes now, what may have actually resorted to that or factor that some could be the... depression. It could not be... Yeah, yeah it, that's the effect yeah, of it, right? Yeah. But now, what leads to some of these things now could be ignorance. Some, sometimes it's majorly ignorance right ignorance not because they don't know per se don't know the effect of it but they are ignorant of their own selves of themselves they don't oh, they don't they have not owned themselves what they can do they, without they, the drugs that is they not they are ignorance of themselves in the sense that they are still living under people's influence do you understand okay. they're still living other people's influence and there's something I, I do i do say i said the real you is that you that is void of a, of a third party influence until you realize the yeah, real you say. in you okay. right until you realize the real in uh, the realness in you okay. you will still be uh, susceptible to influence negative influence at that so I feel those people they are unaware of themselves yet. So when somebody comes to them with any story, cook story of what of uh, the, the the pleasures that these drugs have on them, uh, they just they, they just accept it. Okay, don't you think is also lack of managing stress? You know there are people who cannot manage stress. Uh, there are people who cannot manage situations. Okay, that's why you see they go into depression yeah. and they feel that the only way they can stand out and face society is to take drugs mm. so that whatever they do they do under the influence of drugs yeah don't you think so there's lack of management of not just you knowing yourself yes. but also not being able to manage situations that's that's so? of course that's it that's mm. part of it mm. now so so some persons take drugs to um to alleviate uh, depression, mm. to make them okay, to uh, to to take off stress or to work mm. without much uh, experience of stress, mm. but they are unaware of the fact that when you are taking these things, these things you are taking, the drugs you are taking to relieve stress, could uh, actually have another negative impact or effect yes, on you that definitely. is higher than that stress definitely. you are trying to manage. Yes, definitely. and that's depression, depression that leads to what suicide. Okay. okay. On a concluding note, you are of the Right Minds Network, and your network has been campaigning yes. against uh, use of uh, fake drugs or hard drugs, yeah. drug abuse. So how far, how well? Okay. Us. Basically, I think I want to uh, point out something here. You know, the fight against drug abuse is a collective thing right okay. it's a collective thing it's not it's high time we realized this for us to be able to tackle the issue of drug abuse right that by that i mean the government they have their own their uh, their roles to play which they are doing they are playing their role they are playing their parts mm. in curtailing or reducing the rate of drug abuse in the society okay. but then as individuals we shouldn't relent and feel that it's all the fight of the government it's all a government uh, issue and all of that it's a so effort. now uh, civil society organizations which right minds leaders network is one of okay individuals families right families churches mm -hmm. religious uh, organizations churches mosques public god anybody anywhere anybody should be part of the fight mm -hmm. how when you meet somebody mm -hmm. around your, your your with somebody and then you're experiencing or you are witness you are uh, you're observing something in that person try to be observant enough for you to uh to say come on how are you doing are you well and then yeah, so we what's also up have with a you? very important role yeah. to play in ensuring you know, that uh, hey, and we, one thing now these this, young uh, persons they say they want to you know where it's it's unfortunate that when okay. the society that uh, that 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 feels chilling with the big boys means that you must take alcohol you must take drugs okay. and all of that they want to you bombard know, John they want to, best, no. i know you too well if we we'll give you time <laughs> <laughs> we will not stop, all right? We will not stop. So we want to say a very big thank you. Thank you for being part of this show. Thank okay? you very much like for having All me. we know from what we just said is that drug is like a canker worm yeah. that is eating deep into our youth. Yes. And all hands must be on the deck to yeah. fight this menace. All right, it's time for us to take this report on Social Justice Day. We'll be right back. <laughs>